Hey guys, welcome to another Demon Wolf stream. Uh, um, we will be doing another Kingdom Come Deliverance stream because, well, let's face it, last night I didn't really do much except kill a boar and go around town trying to sell shit. So, um, tonight's stream will be much longer so that there's more room for action as, of course, this is a slower moving game. So, Alright, so give me a few minutes. I'm going to see if I can get some sort of a thumbnail uploaded so that everybody isn't just looking at my big ass forehead. <laughs> Alright, just give me a few. We have also got, um, I'm going to have to give a shout out to Stream Master. And Mateus and Games, they are both streaming right now, playing H1Z1. They're both really cool people, so go check them out if you have not heard of them. <sighs> I'm normally not a battle royale uh, type of person, but um, I will definitely watch H1Z1 anytime over Trash Night. All right. Give me a few minutes. Hopefully, some people will come in. Holy shit! I got another sub. Two hundred and four subscribers. Turn up. Oh god! I can hear mouth breathing and shit. Oh my god. Okay. Hopefully, that's a little better. <clears throat> uh, let's see. No, not. Ah, here we go. I can share it. Awesome. Okay. Share that shit out to Twitter. Facebook as well. I'll be able to share uh, Mateus and Stream Master's streams. never done a thumbnail before, so just be patient. <clears throat> I'll be here all night. Let's get us a win. Man, we've got a fucking five win yet. Yeah. But just so. Uh, 
just just sitting there just uh just meanwhile enjoy enjoy the soundtrack all right where the fuck Ah, there we go. Thumbnail can still be changed. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna have to work on that. Stream Master streams, and we'll get to it. Share it through Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus. It's been 10 minutes into the stream. I still haven't really done anything. I'm sorry, guys. I, I gotta, I gotta support. I gotta support my, you know, my family right now. You know, I gotta support my YouTube family. All right, stream master. Let's see. There you are. About to share the fuck out of this stream. All right, share that shit on Google. Oh, yeah. I'd say as well. 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 I
Share his stream through Facebook. about that um all right let's see huh. all right <laughs> 15 minutes into the stream and I actually start all right could have thought about that a little earlier and done it oh well it's okay All right, so I'll probably I might clip it later just uh so it starts at 13 or 14 minutes. Yeah, if you like what you see, please give a like and subscribe and um donations are always appreciated. Why am I saying it like that? I appreciate any donations you can give. Just go to the about section of my channel. And under links, you will see donate in blue, where you can donate through PayPal. Um, yeah, any amount is appreciated, even if it's 50 cents, I don't care. 25 cents, I don't care. No amount is too big or too small. Goodness knows I need it. Um, hopefully, um, I will get to 250 subs soon, and I'll be able to let y'all donate for free through Gawkbox. Y'all can just play games, earn currency, and donate to me through stickers and all that. All that cool shit. Alright, um... Oh yeah, I was gonna go to the innkeeper to see if he had information on um, how I might prove that Zack the blacksmith is indeed working with Copper and is a suspicious person. So right now... Let me turn down these... Okay. There we go. There we go. Alright. So, okay, what's going on right now is that, you know, of course, there's a big ass war between Sigismund and all subjects who were loyal to King Wenceslas. Alright. And part of that is to fuck up the economy by, um, by minting fake Groschen. 
So I suspect that Zack, the blacksmith, has a hand in that. Because Copper is involved in um, the production of those counterfeit coins. I can't do a whole lot right now because it's nighttime. Well, it's about to... It's, it's about to be daytime, actually. But yeah. There we go. That's better. Yeah, I got Stream Master and Mateus. Mateus' streams running at the same time. It's a little a little distracting, but I'm gonna still be there because I wanna support those who I consider to be my YouTube family. Alright. Alright, so let's show what all is involved in catching these bitch ass counterfeiters. Alright. Someone from Sasal must be providing it. Uh, you were talking to Ulrich. Ulrich. Okay. Zach is highly suspicious. I ought to take a very close look at him, of course. Looks like uh, my best course of action right now is to speak to Ulrich. All right. Hmm. Somebody have a quest for me. Here. Somebody has a quest for me. Am I gonna be able to talk to them? No, not right now. All right. I'll worry about that in a minute. It is so easy for me to get distracted in this game. It's not even funny. Oh, oh, okay. So we suddenly have a mist that just appears out of nowhere. Love on the rain, though. It's very, very soothing. Going the wrong way, aren't I? Yep. love the level of detail in this game, honestly. I mean, even down to the... I mean, it's not so nice, but even it's even uh, even got it down to the, the hay and the poop in the road. The stones, just everything. I really do feel like I've been plopped down into medieval times. It's a little glitchy, but... I think <laughs> everything else kind of makes up for it. And I kind of like that this is one of those games where you won't be able to complete every quest. You won't be able to succeed at everything. Mm. Excuse me. Okay, he. Okay, he's inside the inn. Alright. Okay, ho, I have... I have a fucking bed here. Why am I not allowed to go in? Fucking dumb pricks. Okay. Alright, my energy and nourishments. My energy's looking good, nourishment's looking pretty good too. in there. It could be fish, could be pork, beef, mushrooms, carrots, turnips, onions. Could be anything in there. 
kind of nasty if you think about it. Like, imagine you're trying to eat some beef stew, but it's got this fishy ass taste to it. Ugh. <laughs> Me personally, I hate fish. It's, uh. Ooh, it's disgusting. Whoops. see if I can read this. Nope. Oh, I've already read this book. Never mind. Oh, duh. I can see right there. so easily distracted. Uh, or we're going to be looking at these two today. Wake up, bitches! Wake up! Anything to say? Hello there. My friend, ah, you're a trader. There we go. I'm after some quicksilver. Well, I've been there several times myself and come back empty-handed. They fobbed me off three times over. And who exactly are you talking about? Who's holding back the goods on you? The monastery overseers, or his assistant, more like. So what did the overseer have to say to you? Nothing. Apparently, he doesn't deal in such trifles. Leaves it all to his assistant, the pompous git. Okay. What do you need Quicksilver for? I don't. They do. They mix up the red pigment. Hey, Felix, what's up? I'm taking the church in Ujit. Can you imagine I don't believe I've seen you in my streams before. Welcome. Red? Not really. Then be glad you can. My eyes are just to imagine it. Surely such valuable material can't just vanish. Where can it be? I wish I knew. Every time I ask for the red paint, there's a different reason why they haven't got the quicksilver to mix it. Once they said the goods never arrived, yeah. and another time that the wagon carrying it was ambushed. Ooh, then this smells fishy somewhere. indeed. You think they're lying? Jesus, what do I know? But it seems pretty strange to me. Three times in a row the same thing goes missing. There's bad luck and then there's something else. That's all I need to know for now. Ah. But wouldn't you care to buy something before you go? Or play a game? I really need some money. 
I've been waiting here a while and my stay is getting expensive. Why the hell not? Why not? Show me what you have to offer. Might as well pay this guy for his time. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, a treasure map. I'm definitely buying that off him. Skill book. <laughs> Skill book on drinking. Nice. I will buy that shit. Hell yeah. And some wine. I think I'll sell some herbs. Actually. Actually. Yeah, I'm gonna sell the books I've already read. He will be uh, more willing to deal with me in the future now. Cause it seems the more you go to a merchant, the more uh, the better prices you'll get off them. All right, where is this guy? Upstairs, maybe. Hey, how are you doing? Oh, I'm just. I'm streaming. I didn't get to do much yesterday, but uh, yeah, so I figured I'd do a long stream today. Innkeeper, alehouse maid, you must be upstairs. <laughs> you like the game, huh, don't you? I... <laughs> oh, what did Master Faith have to say? I consulted him and we definitely have a starting point. Well, because you're playing Master it again. Found out they need and you're actually... See, point. it looks like you were on there for quite a while last time we talked. Then, uh, the other part? I see. They have such materials to put on this Exactly. That's why I'm interested in the local forges. Yes, that is good. Yesterday, I heard people from the craftsman's yard by the monastery complaining. They said they could not sleep at night because huh. the blacksmith works all the time till dawn. I see. Yep. That's certainly worth asking about. Have you heard anything else? You said they use quicksilver. There is a painter lodging here who is painting the church in Ujits. I heard him complain also. He said that he went to the monastery for quicksilver and it was all done. Well, that's oh, nice. Up as well. Thanks. Oh, what did you say you were starting? You were playing as a. You're, yeah. You started a Titan as well. Oh, you're on the Moon Titan. <laughs> Something about some evil centipedes. <laughs> um, there will. Okay, yeah. On Destiny, when you've completed all the uh, the story missions, you will be able to have access to the. Curse of Osiris missions and the Warmind missions as well. If uh, you have the DLC, I think you do. You have all the DLC, right? Yeah, yeah. So you'll have uh, access to that. Let's see. Okay, we gotta go to the Overseer. Yeah, especially, um, yeah, once you get high enough, um, once you get high enough level, we'll be able to do, uh, we'll be able to do strikes together, and things, things like that, and then there are raids. I think those are the hardest, that's like the hardest part of the game, but it also gives like the best, uh, some of the best gear. We'll have to. Uh, we'll 
have to see next time I play. Because I won't really be able to answer many of those questions right now. Um, but Felix, this, uh, this is on PS4, if you're wondering. So, yes. Probably. I don't know. Um, it depends on uh, your, uh, settings. You can make it to where your voice is shared or not shared. Yeah, you have to change that yourself. Ooh, let's see. Can I talk to this dude? Overseer's hand. Jesus Christ be praised. Do you have any Quicksilver in stock? Who's asking? Oh, he's acting a little, uh, a little suspicious. Nobody, I'm just asking. Then Somebody in the game. Any. That sounds almost as if you don't want to sell it to me. It's not that I don't want to. It's that I can't. Bollocks. Tell me this instant what you've done with the goods. Nothing! And I'd advise you to calm down. We're on hallowed ground. You're a fine one to speak of hallowed ground. A lying thief in monastic robes. What next? What's next? A whore, a whore just, just as, as, a as a nun. This is blasphemy. <laughs> I'll give you blasphemy. Damn. I'm sure you know what our lord did to the money changers in the temple. What Damn. You mean? Damn. You are, you? <laughs> Tell me Savage. what's going on here and I won't have a reason to. Jesus. But uh, I didn't know anything about any counterfeiting. For your sake, Pretty I Pretty much, that's true. yeah. Now tell me what it plays doing. like Halo. I swear, I, I wouldn't normally do anything like that. It really Get does. To the point. Uh, but I think the movement's the a bit better. Directly to the office. The overseer was somewhere on his rounds. Some nights, it was. Without a crest. Armed. He called himself Sir Yezhek, and he had a lackey with him called Rapporta. A scruffy fellow with a yellow cape. Always whistling, he was. They told me they wanted all the quicksilver we order for the monastery. Of course, I told him that wouldn't be possible. And then what? Did they threaten you? Uh, not at first. Pretty good. Um, I slept for the most part. <laughs> when I refused, they started threatening. Oh my god. This dude is... Oh my god, what the fuck? Oh my god, this dude in one of uh, my favorite streamer's streams trying to preach. No, it's one of my uh, favorite streamers. I've got two streams come. Uh, I've got two streams on at the same time. Is hilarious. This dude is legit trying to be a fucking evangelist. What the hell? I hate people like that. Like, I don't. Oh, it's just, it's annoying. Like, why the fuck? Why the fuck would. What did they do that? They said they know people in the monastery. That they have me thrown out and. And you had been stealing. I mean, before then. You know how it is. I. Work my fingers to the bone and they pay me a pittance. So they knew about you. Yes, they knew my name, everything. Jesus! 
that that shit is annoying. Hand it over to them? I take it up the hill behind the monastery here. There's oh, a big that tree that there with a small chapel underneath. Yes. Sometimes Rapporta is there waiting for me. If not, I leave it there. Like the oh, fuck. Oh, I'm sorry, but the Bible's not even credible. Like it's been written and rewritten Very well. so Thank many you. times. Good luck to you. Hey, you! What are you doing? Fuck off! Before I lose my temper. Come on. Oh, let me get out of this house before he calls the guards. There we go. Sorry, I, I see people trying to come after people in my YouTube family. I gotta stick up for them. Like, the fuck? It's okay to have a religion, but it's not okay to be waving it around like a fucking cock shoving it down people's throats. Like, I'm a Norse fucking Wiccan, but you don't see me saying that my path is the only path. The fuck? How stupid does that sound? I'm sorry, like, what what has God done for me while I was, you know, under the care of an abusive-ass family? Where was the Christian God when my father died, huh? Where was the Christian God when all these wars were happening? Where's the Christian God to care for people that were raped? Where's the Christian God to care about people that were... I don't know, tortured for any reason. But no, this is the 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 same god that people say I don't know. This is the same god that apparently inspired the crusades where it was convert or die. The same god where his followers decided to appropriate pagan holidays and try to make them into Christian ones. If you look at historical evidence, Jesus wasn't even born during Christmas. He was born closer during Easter. Christmas was actually taken from Yule, which is a pagan holiday. It was to try to make pagans more comfortable with the idea of Christianity because if you were any religion other than Christian during, during that time, you were going to be tortured and or executed. And I'm sorry, my idea of heaven is not to is not one where I'm subservient to a god. Why the f if he's so powerful, why the fuck would he need my mindless adoration? Sorry, I'm just venting like if you're like if you're one of those people that doesn't do that like by all means like awesome. If your god brings you peace, 
by all means, that's cool. I'm talking about people that are just like, oh, my path is the only path. It is the right path. Get the fuck out of here. Nobody gives a shit. And then you wonder why Christians are persecuted. It's because y'all stick your noses where they don't fucking belong. I I'm I'm tired of seeing that shit. I've I've dealt with that during all my my teenage years. I'm sick of seeing other people have to have to deal with it. Let's see what time is it. I swear, like people use God as an excuse for everything. Like, for goodness sake, in our government. Okay, the one run by the dumbass Donald Trump. They're trying to use God as an excuse to keep children in fucking cages outside. Meanwhile, the the, the same ones that are abused uh psychologically, physically, and sexually. I I'm sorry, but yeah, these are the same people that go on doing the same shit I've been talking about. Preaching about how holy he is and how... Get the fuck out! Fake ass believer. same bitches that be preaching about holiness, the same ones that be cheating on their wives, cheating on their husbands, lying to people. I'm sorry, but last I heard, those are sins too. But then wanna get on and talk about people's sexuality and shit. Get the fuck out. I bet y'all have overeaten once or twice. That is also named as a sin. Gluttony. At the end of the day, all these rules that are written down, they pretty much say, pretty much being human is a fucking sin. There is no hope for you, therefore you must turn to God and repent. No fucking thank you. And then, basically, they want you to live your life in fear of the afterlife. I'm sorry, no. A life lived in fear of death is no life at all. Might as well just... Actually, no, I'm not gonna say that. Someone might take those words the wrong way. But, either way, like, a life lived in fear of a god is no life at all. Anyhow. Alright. Uh, let's see. Um, I think it's it's longer than the first one. I can tell you that. The first one I finished within like the first one I finished within like four hours. The second one it took me it took me a good several hours to like a day or so. Mm. I don't know if that helps any, but yeah. Oh. Well, that one, I mean, Destiny 2, but it might take you a whole day to do that one. Which, I mean, it's, it's an improvement over... Um, it's an improvement over the first one, I can tell you that much. Talk 
I bet you he's a Jehovah's Witness. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm dead. Ah, Overseer. Hey, bitch, come, come here. Good health to you. Do you remember when they brought the last delivery of stone? Yes. It rained a lot that week, so they let the carriage sit right outside of the gate on the other side of the wall. It took some time before it was dry enough for further transport. And there wasn't anything strange about it? A little strange, I suppose. Usually they bring us a large block of stone, which the builders cut to size. But this time it was a number of smaller pieces. No one complained. They probably saw it as less work. Who's in charge of purchasing materials for the construction? Mainly it's me. I pay the fees and make arrangements for delivery. But those in charge of the actual building take care of the rest. I'm not knowledgeable when it comes to the quality of stone. They had the red stone delivered from a long way. They take care of storage as well. Yes, but usually whatever arrives is used up straight away. The construction is in full progress. Good luck to you. are new please leave a like and subscribe I would appreciate it eh, there's just one actually I am going to open a link to my channel as well because sometimes on a uh, PlayStation it's not exactly accurate as to how many people are watching it's, yeah Somebody left a like. Awesome. Alright. Cool. Shit. I've got too many tabs open, I think. Yeah. Yeah, for once the- oh, oh, I see why it's, uh, kind of lagging a little bit. Ugh, the battery's low. Nothing, the battery's just low. I know what that is. That's a cat video, isn't it? Is it the one where they're, uh, it's a big fat cat, it's like gray, and they're brushing his fur and it hit a weird spot? <laughs> I knew it! <laughs> because I've seen that video a lot. It says, nom 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 nom. The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? There we go. 
You look fit, Grandmaster. So as to fit in. I don't want it known that I'm in town. Why? I don't want to alarm our prey. Gossip spreads quickly, and if those scoundrels learn we're onto them, they'll flee. That does make sense. Smart. So what have you found out so far? I found out where they get their quicksilver from. You were right, it was the monastery. Hmm. It was the only logical explanation. It changed hands on the hill behind the monastery. Have you been there to have a look around? Not yet. Maybe it would be worth the time. I'll go and see. And have you found out who's behind it? Someone called Rapata. Not much, but it's a start. At least it's not a common name. Listen, Henry. I had another thought on the way here. Those counterfeiters have to have a punch die to make the fake coins. Yes, of course. That's sophisticated work. And there's a man I know who works at the monastery yard. Master Engraver Jerome of Silesia. You don't suppose nope. that he's... I started playing Destiny yeah, after... Uh, I know him well. He never do anything Actually, like I think that. I started playing but after the Osiris so expansion came out. Very well, I'll ask him. But ask with tact. I don't want I'm still watching that video. <laughs> and I prefer you not to mention me at all. I'll try to think of something. I thought I heard that not cat again. Oh, num, 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 num. God be with you. Okay, so there's about a good, I think, 10 second delay or so. Uh, and of course, it's going to take a long ass time saving. All right, here we go. Some of these quests take so long that whatever towns that you're nearby, that kind of becomes the whole world for a minute. I don't know, some of these quests have kind of a, an isolating feel to them. Ooh, looks like Henry's gonna need to get some kitty cat soon. Yes, pussy. Because <laughs> it gives me, I think, a, either a plus one or plus two charisma bonus. And it helps me with, you know, that helps me, me with uh, persuading people. Although, uh... What the fuck am I hearing right now? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what the fuck am I hearing right now? there. Huh? Um, I go to the whorehouse, which is marked by, uh, white tents. You speak to the proprietor. I'm, I'm guessing that's the pimp. <laughs> and you say, well, I'd like to use your, I'd like to use the bathhouse services. And then you choose, you want to pay for a wench and everything that comes with that. Your wounds are healed, your clothes are washed, and you get that kitty. I don't think you can get an STD, which is kind of weird. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I've just been lucky because... I like to have that alpha male bonus every chance that I get. Get your lazy ass up, bitch! <laughs> I hope I can be of help to you, Knight. How goes the work, Master? Getting there, getting there. You need something, my boy? What are you doing here, anyway? You're in an engraver's shop, my boy. We're engraving, of course. 
Huh? Yeah, the engraving what? And what's it used for? Oh, we engrave wood and stone as well as metal. Here in the monastery, it's mostly about decoration. Normally, yeah. Um, and it also depends on what kind of guns you're most comfortable with. But yeah, um, if it has higher damage, just just go with that. Unless, okay, like say you have two SMGs. Say you have one that does. Um, I think it has to be legendary though, to do what I'm thinking of. Like say you have two SMGs. One does a hundred damage. One does, I don't know, a hundred and twenty, and they're both le and they're both legendary. There's a option to infuse. What that what that means is that you use uh sh those legendary shards, and um, you basically consume the the weapon with the higher amount of damage to enhance the weapon you already have. Like say you really like certain bonuses that it has. Say it has really low recoil. You want to keep that, but you want that damage. You can consume that other weapon to increase your damage. Does that make sense? So what's happened to yeah. Florian? He shares the faith of the pharaohs, but today, the fifth scourge of Egypt did smite him. The plague. Or so his message advised me. Jesus Christ, the plague. Do remain calm. I'm quite certain the plague from which Florian is suffering wasn't a judgment from on high. Or if it was, it was a judgment on excessive drinking. <laughs> I'm told such an ailment can be a true cirrhosis of the liver. That's what that is. Does Florian have any enemies? A man wow. such as he certainly owes money at every turn, and the parents of local girls are undoubtedly <laughs> displeased with his attempts to propagate. However, most recently it was that fury from the baths who accosted him in quite a spectacular rage. <gasps> oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, so this guy... Okay, so apparently I can't get STDs, but other people in the well, game can get STDs when they visit the bathhouses. I don't frequently feel sorry for my near do well apprentice, but on that occasion I made an exception. <laughs> do you have any idea why she did it? Oh, she was screaming about some Florian girl, some flighty bathmaid, Esther. I would say that Florian had felt the joys of spring and acted accordingly. Mm. Although one would have thought they'd be used to that sort of thing at the bathhouse. Oh. What's he like, your apprentice, Florian? I'm afraid that his exuberant youth has taken its toll. He's been acting strangely of late. I fear he has delusions of persecution. I don't really know what you mean. <laughs> Recently, for example, he told me that someone was following him. You sound like me the now. The next day, he bought a padlock from the blacksmith and locked up his chest. As though I would ever sleep. Oh, I hear him. pussy. In any case, why the interest are you looking for him? Something like that. <laughs> May I ask why? <laughs> hey, Michael. What's up? I have a message for him. A message? Who would be interested in that maestral? Other than his furious and deeply disappointed master, of course. About your question, you'll find him at home. No doubt feverishly dying. He sleeps in the baker's cellar. Ah, thank you. Thank you. I'll leave you to your work. Take care now. You. Huh. <laughs> There's so much other noise in the background, I can't... I can't really hear you very well. Orbs of light. Oh, that recharges your um your ultimate ability. Pick those up whenever you see them if your your super ability is not charged yet. I think that's what's called super or whatever. You know what I mean. Uh, watch this. <laughs> this quest is probably gonna take a whole nother hour to do.
at odds with Apprentice Florian. At odds? I'll give you at odds. It's that sod's fault they took my Esther. Poor girl. I shudder to think what's become of her. What exactly happened? This man came in wanting a bath, and Esther with it. She doesn't normally offer that kind of service, but I didn't see the harm, so I sent her in to him. And suddenly I hmm. hear screams. So I run out and I see the bastard pulling her out of the tank. Um and you her into a boat. get you get points for leveling up, you can unlock other abilities with your subclasses. I assume that Florian. Knows. Yes, you need to do that. That'll you really, really help girls. you. They don't get much of a choice. Every other knave has a turnip for a brain. And if they don't, they're relatives. Oh. And then some young dandy turns up who writes her little poems. What's the poor girl to do? Uh, I think you press the options button to look at your inventory. The and then you should effects. see a diamond-shaped icon at the upper left part of the screen. That's where your subclasses are. And there are three. And yes, you will be able to unlock all three as you level up. What did the bailiff make of it? Don't even get me started on that. He's another fine youth. I won't say what. I told him everything, but he says he won't do nothing about it. How's that then? He wouldn't tell me to my face, of course. But people here don't think much of us. There's some as reckon my Esther deserves oh, what she got. Oh, damn. Poor girl. Damn, I know she's a paid hoe, but damn. Fuck. <laughs> Now I, I gotta investigate what happened to a prostitute. Where can I find this Florian? I'd like to ask him a few questions. He works in the engraver's workshop at the monastery craftsman's yard. And if he's not there, he'll be holed up like the rat he is in the cellar he rents from the baker. He's afraid of me, for sure. It sounds like you were close to Esther. I loved her like my very own. She came to me as an orphan, like a wolf child she was. I raised her and taught her and gave her a job, and now she's gone. Who knows if she's even alive? I think that's when you can start doing um, strikes. Um, there will be adventures to do on each of the planets, um, opportunities to get better gear. But it's kind of a, a slow climb up a... Um, a very steep cliff. I can tell you that much. Um, but yeah, definitely tell me once you get there, because if we both play together, um, it'll go much faster. God bless. And then just tell me, um, oh yeah, you're, you're a hunter, right? So then, at that point, I could probably switch to my tank, or my, um, warlock. I'm gonna have to do some work on them, though, because they're not as powerful. Um, you'll get gunsmith materials when you get engrams from him. Uh, you'll get guns. Um, you can purchase mods from him. It'll it'll just you know make your it'll make whatever you have a bit more powerful. I'm at your service, Sir Knight. You look quite sprightly for an invalid. What? Who the hell are you? My name's Henry, and I'm making inquiries for Sir Radzig Kobola. And what do you want from me? Straight to the point then. All right. I've been investigating counterfeit money, and the trail led me straight to you. Does the name Rapporteur mean anything to you? Um, I, I don't know. You Maybe. might. Don't bother. Uh, depending on how much you, you make the uh, the sit there and just farm enemies you for experience. I can't say anything. I'll deny everything and you've got nothing on me. No evidence, just accusation. You just incriminated yourself. One man's word against another. Like I said, I'll deny everything. But do you really think that's going to help you? Your word means nothing. You've got the tools, the knowledge and the workshop. The only thing missing is a motive, but I'm guessing it's money. I don't give a fuck about money. So what then? Those bastards kidnapped Esther. If I don't cooperate, they'll kill her.
Who is Esther? My girl, of course. That scum took her right out of the bathhouse. That doesn't begin to justify what you did. I don't care. This isn't about me. Listen, I'll tell you everything. I promise. But only if I know that Esther's safe. Damn, this is just leading. This quest is lead me, leading me from one thing to another. And what can puny little me do face with those strapping great villains? Look, Florian, I'm sorry for what you're going through, honestly. But I'm not the only one who's after these people. As soon as they get wind of something, they'll be out of here and Esther will be gone with them. If Rapporteur finds I've told you anything, they'll kill her. Not if I catch Rapporteur first. He's here in town, isn't he? Yes, he is. <coughs> they found me in the tavern one evening. Caught me when I went to the ship pile. They started to badger me about mm -mm. working for them. They? Yes, Rapporteur. And a night they called Sir Yezek. And then what? They explained what they wanted from me, and I told them to sod off. I'm guessing that didn't go down too well. It wasn't all that bad. They just threw me on the dung heap and left. Ew. And I thought it was just a drunk joke. Into a pile of shit. But then they took Esther. How disgusting. How did you hand over the punch die to them? Rapporteur waited for me behind the church. I didn't want to give it to them without seeing Esther first. And did they let you? Yes, although I don't really know why. They took me to a derelict farm in the Scalitz Hills. My poor Esther, they'd scared her half to death. So at least you know she's alive. Who knows? It was a while ago. And they never let her go, even after I did what they wanted. <laughs> they said they'd be needing more. More punch dice. <laughs> They wear out I'm pretty sure he just saw that. He just... Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure y'all saw his head just kind of jerk randomly. That was... That was weird. Why didn't you tell anyone? At first, I took it for a bad joke. And then, when they snatched Esther, there was nothing to be done. Where will I find Rapporteur? He's usually wherever I am. What does that mean? He watches me. Everywhere I go. And when I'm at home, he sits on the bench in the square, watching my house. So oh, he's there shit. now? Hard to say. Sometimes I see him in the tavern on the green, buying supplies. Alright. At least I know where to start. And you go to work tomorrow, you hear? Why? Because we have to lure him out. And besides... Your master will surely be glad to see you. I have my doubts. I suppose I'd better go. I'd hate the bastard to get away. Go. I hope you get revenge. May the Lord watch over you. Let's go beat that ass. Alright, so I'm looking for a man who is always whistling and he wears a yellow cloak. I know that much. Ha! Come here, bitch! Are you Rapporteur by any chance? Pardon me? Do we know each other? No, but I'm hoping to change that. Uh, um, well, I, I don't have much time right now. I'd best be off. Nah, bitch. Over. You ain't going nowhere. All right then. What do you want? I know you buy quicksilver for those counterfeiters. Ah. Uh, it seems there's no point making excuses. None. Now tell me where their workshop is. Of course, of course. That that will be the best solution. So. Uh, let's leave it for another time. No, 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 no. What the fuck? Okay, that's a little bit broken. No, I give up. Yeah, give up, bitch. Okay, that was really weird. 
so. That was really fucking weird. I will. I will. Just don't hurt me, please. What do you want from me? Tell me where the workshop is. Don't worry. Your master won't be punishing you for betraying mm -hmm. me. You're both gonna have too many other problems. It's in the Scarlet Spines. That doesn't narrow it down very much. On the eastern side of Scarlet's Hill, there's an abandoned mine gallery. Well, backwards compatibility. Now there's a small. So basically, you can play PS4 games inside. on it. Oh, that'd be cool. I am definitely not giving up my PS4. Hell no. Nah. That'd be a waste- out of wasted like $300 just to trade it in. Who is your lord? So Yeje, the Ronoff. That's what he calls himself. Yeah, the but- Ronoff yeah. Because it was a- it was a bundle. Well, most PS4s are about 300 bucks. Still. What happened to him? Ronoff used to belong to Vincent, Count Lichtenberg. After his death, it fell to Margrave Jobs, and he had it pulled down. He knew full well that Vincent's vassals would resist him. Why? Everyone knows that when a lord dies without his, the king can confer his estate on whoever he pleases. But Vincent had the sentence. Ronoff only fell to the Margrave because he declared them all illegitimate. All because Vincent had refused to fight for him against Sir Brokoff. So Yezhek led a revolt from the vassals, and the Ops rounded them all up. Only so Yezhek got away. Since then, he's become the scourge of the domain. So who's Sir Yezhek working for? Don't tell me he just took it into his head one day to start forging coins. That's not for me to know. So Yezhek was on speaking terms with various lordships. Such as? We were often guests at the monastery, but I slept in the hayloft, so I heard nothing. And apart from that? In the camp, you'd occasionally see a Hungarian nobleman, but I don't know what he was doing there, or who he is. Who are you, anyway? They call me Rapota. I used to be the executioner's henchman in Brno. And how did you come to be serving Sir Jezek? I helped him escape from prison. If I was going to serve anyone, better Sir Yezhek than the Executioner. So you saw being a brigand's henchman as a step up in the world? I thought if things changed and he stopped marauding, he might get run off back and take me into his service. Well, after this little escapade, you can forget about that. You'll be lucky if you don't end up swinging uh, on the gallows. It's all wait, the what? same anyway now. I've betrayed him. Sorry, I'm having a hard time concentrating on both the game and you at the same time. <laughs> I think I've heard enough. Can I ask you something? I mean, yeah, yeah as long as you're, you you know, keep looking for I gear that it, you know. It's a horrible death. I prefer yeah, it's pretty much a measure of your overall power. Now. Like, basically, if you go up against an enemy that has a power of, say, I don't know, 130, you're gonna have a pretty rough time. An honorable death. No chance. It's the dungeons for you, and the sort of punishment a counterfeiter deserves. Don't worry. In time, you'll be glad of the gallows. <laughs> Fuck. No mercy for this bitch. Is a mess. <laughs> now you sit there and think about what the fuck you did, you little punk ass bitch. Oh my god, dude. 
<sighs> fucking guard just ran right into me. That's one thing I think they need to change a little bit. They need to make the... Uh, the... They need to make some of the AIs a little bit smarter, like... Somebody will just run into you and say, Watch where you're going! Bitch, you ran into me, the fuck? <laughs> the guard will get mad at you, cause... They bumped into you. Really? Suck a fucking dick. I finally found out where the Forger's workshop is. Master Feyfar was right. The Forger's are sticking close to the supply source. Their workshop is somewhere in the mines. The entrance is on the eastern side of the hill. I've no idea what to expect there, but I'd rather go there with some backup. I will be glad to be here. Lead on. Oh, shit. I think we're about to see some action now. Finally! <laughs> I mean, pretty sure you see white guys doing that shit too. Fuck! I'm going to enjoy this. 
Yeah. I can't fucking concentrate right now. I'm in the middle of a fight. I'm going to enjoy this. Where the fuck is my backup when I need him? The fuck? Oh my god, please don't tell me. I'm gonna have to do this shit over again. Fuck. What I'm trying to figure out is where the fuck was my fucking backup? Okay, so I didn't get set back that far. Okay, let's see. Hey. Uh, dude, I'm gonna have to actually go, cause... I can't... I can't... Yeah, I cannot... I can't fucking concentrate trying to and try to talk to you at the same time. No offense. Yeah, but I'll see you later. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. So I guess I didn't get set back too, too badly. Alright, so I guess... I think, I think I lost my backup when I went through those damn bushes. That's what happened. And I really messed up where I got myself, uh, yeah, I got myself backed up into the damn bushes and up against rocks and shit. Not a very nice way to fight, is it? And I see some of the objects still take some time to render. Hopefully they can, hopefully they can fix that. pretty much speed right through the dialogue because I pretty much know what happens at this point. <laughs> Usually here. 
Um, it's the apprentice he shares, Florian. Jesus Christ. Do yeah, blah, 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 blah. Does Florian have any... A map? Yeah. Okay. Thank All you. Right. I'll leave you to your work. May the Lord watch over you. Talk to the Madame of the Baths. Hey! What the hell? Ah, fuck you. Here you're at odds with Apprentice Florian. At odds? Where can I find He works in the in Take care. Do you want straight to the point then? Um, don't bother. I can't say anything. Uh, excuse me. You just encrypt one man's. Would you really think that? I don't give a fuck about money. So what then? Those bastards. That doesn't begin. I don't care. Listen. What, so I'm to go. I know where they keep. Look, Florian, I'm sorry. If Rapita finds... I Not if I catch Rapita. Yes. He they found me. They? Yes. And then what? They explained... I'm guessing that didn't... It wasn't all that. Where will I find Rap? He's usually wherever... What does that mean? He watches... So he's there now? It's hard to say. All right. All right Why? All right, all right, all right. Because we... I have my... <sighs> all right. I Let's suppose I'd better bitch. go. Go. I hope you get revenge. Hopefully I don't die again. Let me turn on the light. The camera's getting rather grainy. <clears throat> there we go. That's better. Oh, there you are, bitch. No, 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 no. Come here. Come here, ho. Are you Rapporteur by any chance? Pardon me? Do we know? No, but I'm hoping to. Uh. It'll only take a moment. Um. I know you buy Quicksilver for those counterfeiters. Uh. None. No. Of course, of course. That. So? Uh. Let's leave it for a- Nah, bitch.
So, I give up. Yeah, you so, better talk, bitch. Are you ready to talk? I will. I will. Just don't hurt me, please. What do you want from me? Tell me where the workshop is. Don't worry. Your master won't be punishing you for betraying him. You're both gonna have too many other problems. It's in the Skullet's mines. That doesn't narrow it down very much. On the eastern side of Skullet's Hill, there's an abandoned mine gallery. Well, it used to be abandoned. Now there's a small camp in front of it, and the workshop is inside. Who is your lord? So Yezhek of Ronoff. That's what he calls himself, although Ronoff Castle's long gone. What happened to him? Ronoff used to belong to Vincent, Count Lichtenberg. After his death, it fell to Mark. Why? Everyone knows that when a lord dies without issue, the king can confer his estate. But Vincent had the sentence, all because Vincent had refused to fight for him against Sir Prokop. So who's Sir Yeshek working for? Don't tell me he just took it into his head one day to start forging coins. That's not for me to know, sir. Such as? We were often guests at the monastery, but I slept in the hayloft, so I heard nothing. Well, in the camp, you'd occasionally see a Hungarian nobleman, but I don't know what he was doing there, or who he is. Who are you, anyway? They call me Rapota. I used to be the executioner's henchman in Brno. And how did you come to be serving Sir Yezhek? So you saw being a brigand's henchman as a step up in the world? I... Well, after this little escapade, you can forget about that. You'll be lucky if you don't end up swinging on the gallows. And it's all the same anyway now. I've betrayed him. I think I've heard enough. Can I ask you something? Yes? I don't want to hang. It's a horrible death. I prefer you just kill me here and now. No, oh, why not? As you wish. Our Father, who art in heaven. Asked me to kill him, why not? Might as well leave him out in the streets for the dogs to eat him.
One ale over here, please. I finally found out where the forger's workshop is. Master Feyfar was right. The forgers are sticking close to the supply source. Their workshop is somewhere in the mines. The entrance is on the eastern side of the hill. I've no idea what to expect there, but I'd rather go there with some backup. I will be glad to give it. Lead on. Alright, I should have uh, another save your schnapps. So I don't want to go through all that again. That would just make for a very, very boring stream. something different. I'm gonna use the Warhammer. Because that's more effective against um, opponents with plate armor. <laughs> Excuse me. There we go. There we go. Let's... Oh, sweet. I'm still not overloaded. Perfect. Warhammer. Uh... Ooh, I do need... I do need that shield, though. this is gonna go because I haven't really used any blunt weapons. We shall see. This motherfucker. I see. I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to wait for him. Because I'm not trying to go in without backup. Better keep the fuck up. Slow poke at us. <clears throat> hey, bitches! What's going on? Do you have a place to sleep? There. You do, so don't What's complain. That? We. Oh, no. Look, it's crawling Too out. Long. Get over here! Blood will Over here! Stand. Where is everyone? Oh. Quick! You all get what for. Yeah. Raise the alarm! Watch out! Two arms! Get over here! Ah. Fired from here. You're dead. Come. Come here, Lily Liver. Hit. 
bitch. What the hell? Weak at the knees, have you? What? No more holding around. Bitch. You call that combat.
beat his ass. Oof. Oof. Wow. He got beat the fuck up. I'll take that trunk key, though. At least I can make a couple thousand off of, uh, his equipment. Kinda nervous though, I think, uh, I thought one of the bandits was still kinda lurking around. got to make sure that everything is in good condition. was fighting. I, I don't think that was everyone. I think whoever else was there ran off. I'll put away my weapon for now. Ooh, yes, I'll take that. Uh, ooh, yes, I'll take this. Uh, Ulrich is in Valhalla now.
guess that was all of them. Otherwise, uh, I would have been attacked in my sleep. kind of goodies we got. If any. Specifically food. That will also restore health would be nice. I don't know you. I'm here at the command of the royal hetman, Sir Radzig Kabila. Radzig Kabila. The king's hetman. <laughs> I see. I'm here to place you under arrest. I gathered as much. And you came alone. Ha! <laughs> Very daring of you, I must say. <laughs> they killed everybody outside. <sighs> I'll manage. Sometimes even a king can be deposed without an army. So, I'm a king now, and you want to dethrone me? By the way, who betrayed me? It was your lackey. Rapoda? Hmm, so we're even at last. He saved me from the gallows once. What have you done with him? He got what he deserves. Poor Rapoda. Still, he didn't do too badly while it lasted. Well, never mind. It was nice talking to you. The company down here hasn't been terribly convivial. But I hope you don't imagine I'm just going to follow meekly after you like a lamb to the slaughter. And where would you want to go? Anywhere. Anywhere else is preferable to Kobila's dungeon. Really? You can't go to Moravia. The Margrave himself is after you there. And in Bohemia, the kings may change, but the coin remains, my friend. What do you mean? Whoever gets to be king, they can't afford to have someone forging money. Do you think I'm doing this on my own? No, but when the kingdom's back in order, and it'll be time to shut this little operation down, they'll be only too happy to let you take the blame. Counterfeiting money gets no clemency. 
It doesn't matter. Kobila will string me up from the highest tree in any case. Maybe. But you're very shrewd and very persuasive. And you might know a few things that are worth more than your life. It's up to you. Either you give yourself up and try to make a deal with Sir Radzig, or you'll be on the run for the rest of your life. A deal with Sir Radzig? It's true they say he's a canny man. If you cooperate, you stand a chance. Oh, very well then. May as well climb straight into the maw of the beast. So let's go. Master Feyfar will be itching to ask you a few questions. <laughs> and I'm sorry, it has the game has crashed. <sighs> Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> 